Update driver. Step 1. Go to search bar, type dvmgmt.msc, then press Enter to open Device Manager. Step 2. Expand mice and other pointing devices, right-click your mouse and pick Update Driver. Step 3. Follow on-screen instructions to update the driver. Step 4. After the process finishes, restart your computer. Step 5. The moment the screen comes back on, pair the mouse again and see how things turn out. Note, on occasions, you have to uninstall and reinstall the driver of Microsoft Wireless Mouse 5000. Step 1. Go to search bar, type devmgmt.msc, then press Enter to open Device Manager. Step 2. Expand mice and other pointing devices. Right-click your mouse and pick Uninstall Device. Step 3. Check the checkbox next to delete the driver software for this device before hitting. Okay, last but not least, restart your computer. Assuming that things proceed smoothly, the mouse is going to work as expected. Think about Bluetooth. Step 1. Go to search bar, type devmgmt.msc, then press Enter to open Device Manager. Step 2. Expand Bluetooth. Locate the Bluetooth adapter and take a look at the Bluetooth version. Step 3. If the Bluetooth version is older than 4.0, you cannot use Microsoft Wireless Mouse 5000 on your computer. On the other hand, if the Bluetooth version is 4.0 or newer but you cannot use the mouse, run the Bluetooth troubleshooter. To do so, press Windows Plus I to open Settings. Go to Update and Security. Troubleshoot, Additional Troubleshooters, Select Bluetooth and choose Run the Troubleshooter. Delete Mouse Software. Step 1. Go to the search bar, type Control Panel and press Enter. Step 2. Change view by to category. Then hit Uninstall a program under Programs. Step 3. Find mouse software, right-click it and pick Uninstall. Step 4. Restart your computer. Change batteries. Step 1. Locate the battery access cover on your mouse. Step 2. Remove the battery cover by applying pressure on the clip to expose the plastic cover. Step 3. Remove old batteries from the mouse. Step 4. Insert new batteries into the mouse. Remember to check if the optical beam inside the mouse lights up. Step 5. Return the back cover to its position. Pair the device to your computer and determine whether the issue persists.